How's it going? Charles Bonston here. We are, obviously, we have a nice photographer um, behind the camera right now, so we're getting a little bit better. You guys asked for it, so it's going to be a little bit better editing in, in, in uh, anything, literally, when it comes to music and everything like that, to spice it up a little bit. So today we're going to be talking about branding. Branding is very important for multiple reasons. Number one is that that's who you are. You know, people talk about personality. Essentially, your personality is who you are in person but your brand is who you are online. This is why it's important. Number one is more people post things online. This is the funny thing, is more people post things online than they actually discuss in person. Your political views, your religious views, you put everything online, that's essentially your brand. And ironically enough, your brand now translates offline because more people post their personality online. So this is really what it boils down to, is that your brand is how people, when they hear your name or they hear your company, what do they think about? What, what do they, like, what's the first thing they, that comes to their mind, number one? Number two is, how do they feel? What's their feeling when you, when you hear Apple or Exxon or Levi? So we're gonna talk about, really quick, actually improving your brand or the brand that you have online. So this is really important because Ty Lopez, you know, nothing to say anything about Ty Lopez, but essentially the guy, he, him, and I've actually heard uh, Tim Ferriss are just, they're, they're just addicts where how they're seen online and they're a little bit different in person. So you don't wanna be that way. You don't wanna be someone that's insane online that posts all the time, but you also don't wanna be someone that's super conservative. You literally have Ty and Tim as these guys that they're so obsessed with their brand online that they're totally different in person. You wanna translate it online, however you don't wanna go over the top. So, I know this video is all over the place, but you have to be conscious of your actual brand, number one, and that's actually an extension of your personality. It was actually a while ago when Facebook first came out for, these, for the older generation, it was like 09, 2010, and these two neighbors were talking about, you know, everything about what they like, what they don't like, and ironically enough, this is really funny, is that they became Facebook friends, and then two weeks later, they saw each other and one of them was like, I can't believe you just posted that. And it was like during the election season, things like that. And they never even talked about their political views. But because they actually, one of the neighbors posted their political view, the other person didn't like it, unfriended them, and then they don't even talk in their neighbors. So that's the extension of your brand. Avoid religious, avoid uh, political and the person that's actually holding the the camera and myself we've been talking about that a lot is like what kind of brand do you want what kind of brand do you want your company to be so I said let's go with the lifestyle I love the lifestyle the BPI lifestyle which is health wealth you know relationships you know it's just all encompassing so be cognizant of your brand make sure that it's an extension of your personality and not the other way around where it's fake and when people meet you they're like hold on wait you are not that person online so have an awesome day. Leave, a, leave your comments below. I'll talk to you guys soon.